What's up, everybody, and welcome back. Uh, yes, the World Cup is here. The drawing happened just a little bit ago. Uh, I hurried up and put together a, you know, a little bit of a thing here to go through my first reaction of who will place where and, and all of that. So we'll just go ahead and jump into it. But please tell me in the comments below what you think my thoughts are. And tell me what your thoughts are, who who you think will move on to the knockout stages where each team will place in their group. But here, we'll just jump right into it. So, Group A, we got Qatar, Ecuador, Senegal, Netherlands. Group B is England, Iran, U.S., and then the Euro playoff. Then in Group C, we have Argentina, Saudi Arabia, Mexico, and Poland. Group D, which is France, the IC Playoff 1, Denmark, and Tunisia. So, pretty good so far. Uh, I feel like those ones are all spread out. So then we move to Group E. I think this is going to be a difficult group. Uh, Spain, IC Playoff 2, Germany, and Japan. With Germany and Spain in that one, that, that's going to be a good, uh, a good group. Group F, you have Belgium, Canada... Morocco, Croatia. Group G, you have Brazil, Serbia, Switzerland, and Cameroon. And then Group H, to round it all out, you have Portugal, Ghana, Uruguay, and Korea. Republic. So I think that in my first, my first, I guess, reaction to it is I actually think these are pretty good groups. Um, I'm okay with the U.S. group. I kind of wish we didn't get that Euro playoff. I kind of wish Ecuador was in there to make it a little bit easier. Uh, but I think that they did a good job. I don't really think that there is a group of death, in my opinion. Um, yeah, I, I just don't see it. I, I think that I think the the craziest group would be I don't know maybe Spain and Germany, like two big names facing off there. Maybe Denmark and France. Eh, I, not really. So, with that being said, um, I'm going to have to cut the camera for, you know, the, the rest of the show here. So, we're going to cut it and we're going to move on here. So, we go into Group A. And, um, so, Group A is Qatar, Ecuador, Senegal, Netherlands. I think that Ecuador will finish in fourth uh, in this group, I just don't think that they're that good of a side. Uh, moving on, third, I think Qatar will finish in third. So that leaves Senegal and the Netherlands as one and two. I think that Senegal actually wins this group. I don't know why, but from my initial reaction, yes, there will be more videos on this. And I will probably try to get more in-depth on how each team just to know more about each team because, you know, right now there's some teams that I'm not, I don't know too much about. So this is just like a quick reaction. So yeah, it might not end up this way. I've heard some people say that Qatar is going to move on and everything too from stuff that I've read, but that leaves Netherlands coming in at second in the group. So Senegal, Netherlands move on to the round of 16. Now we move on to group B. We have England, Iran, U.S., and then the Euro playoff, which is Ukraine, uh, Scotland, or Wales. I do believe that Iran will finish last in this group. And then I think that whoever wins the playoff will finish third. And then I think you guys will guess this one. England first, U.S. second. Both England and U.S. moving on to the round of 16. So... That's the first two groups. So we're moving on to Group C. We have Argentina, Saudi Arabia, Mexico, and Poland. Uh, I think this is going to be a good group. I think it's going to be difficult to really guess this group. I, it just depends on what, what teams show up. I feel like Argentina can be inconsistent. I can also feel like Poland, you know, just from a initial reaction can be inconsistent and then of course Mexico is very inconsistent we know them from CONCACAF so in this group I think fourth place will go to Saudi Arabia then I think Mexico will finish third and they will be 
out. They will get knocked out of the World Cup in the group stages. And then with that being said, I believe that Argentina tops this group and Poland comes in second. So tell me, you guys got to tell me what your thoughts are in the comments below because I'm excited for all of this. And I'm very excited for even what the kits will look like for every team for the World Cup. So let's move on to Group D. Uh, that is France, the playoff one. And I, I don't remember off the top of my head what those teams are. Denmark and Tunisia. Uh, I think this is definitely going to be an easy one for France. So I kind of just gave you my number one. But last place will be Tunisia. Then I think the playoff one will finish in third. France coming in at first. And I think Denmark moves on. I think that they have a good enough team that they will make it to the round of 16 in this World Cup. So please, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you like the content that I'm creating, you know, the thumbs up. If you like all, everything that I'm doing, please subscribe. You know, even in the comments, tell me, you know, what I should change up on the on the channel. And, you know, I'll take any ideas to try to flip, flip it around to make it as much, like, better as I can. So, again, if you've made it this far in the video, thank you for watching. I definitely appreciate it. Next up, we have Group E coming down the final stretch, the second half of the, the groups here. We got Spain, the playoff two. Germany, and Japan. I think that the playoff two team in this group will finish last. Third, I think Japan will come in. I, I just think that Japan might... I know that it was really hard for me to pick between those two. They could easily be flip-flop for those two. But I will go with uh, Japan coming in third. And then I have Spain topping this group with Germany coming in second to move on to the uh, the round of 16. That moves us to Group F, which is Belgium, Canada, Morocco, and Croatia. I think that it will be a coin toss for second place in this group between Canada and Croatia. Um, I think Monaco, Morocco, I'm sorry, I, I think I said Monaco. I don't know why. It's Morocco. I apologize. I think Morocco comes in last, and this might throw some people. I think Croatia comes in third. Belgium comes in first. I think Canada gets that second spot in Group F to move on to the round of 16. The Just the way that they played in CONCACAF, if we exclude the last window, which that last window, I think they were just going through the motions to get through it. If they play like they did in all the other games... Canada is going to be hard to beat. They are a very good team. They sit back and they get you with that counter. And then Davies should be healthy by then. I believe I read somewhere that he might be actually back for Bayern uh, starting like this week or next week. So if he's back, that just adds to it. I think Canada can move out of this group uh, coming in second behind Belgium. I do not think anybody can top Belgium in, in this group though. This leads us into Group G which is Brazil, Serbia, Switzerland, and Cameroon. I think this group for, for people is going to throw, this is going to throw people off for me um, with my predictions on this. Um, I think that Serbia will finish last in this group. I think Serb uh, Switzerland will come in third. And of course, Brazil is going to come in first. But I do believe that Cameroon is going to move on to the round of 16. There has to be upset somewhere, right? I think this might be one. I think that uh, Cameroon squeezes by Switzerland and uh, moves on to the, the final 16. Which leads us into the final group, Group H. And I also think this one might spin people and think that they don't agree with me. Uh, because I think that Uruguay... Finishes last in this group, followed by Korea Republic. I think they'll come in third. I do think P Portugal will come in first, but I think Ghana is also going to move on in this uh, in in this group, and I think that that's who will make it to the round of sixteen. So, with that being said, I have Senegal, Netherlands. 
England, U.S., Argentina, Poland, France, Denmark, Germany, Spain, Canada, Belgium, Cameroon, Brazil, Portugal, and Ghana all moving on. So thank you for watching. Please tell me what you guys think of this initial reaction. Tell me about your team and what group they're in. And do you think that it's an easy group for them or if it's a bad group? Um, but yeah, please tell me in the comments below and we'll see you for the next video.